We're here on the beautiful Charles River in Prague and we're about to introduce the new Thermo Scientific ISQEC. It's a single quadrupole mass spectrometer for IC and for HPLC. For me it's the marriage of a very powerful ion source with a very established, very robust single quadrupole mass spectrometer which comes from our GCMS platform. So we really bring together two great technologies we tie it together with the super software to make it very easy to use for customers. The little notch where you can measure the capillary length on there is a really nice little feature because on other, other instruments you have to do that manually and sometimes you can get that wrong. That sort of attention to detail is really nice. One of the other nice features of that is the accessibility to the source. So the ability to be able to just take the front end off very, very simply and have access to the whole uh, front for maintenance and servicing is a really nice feature. It's an area uh, or a type of species called potentially mutagenic impurities uh, where I think this, this instrument could uh, allow us to get down to very low levels uh, very easily and uh, become a routine part of the workflow. It's actually pretty interesting that they integrated all the key features that I would like to see in a smaller system. Here everything is downsized a little and uh, I think it will be beneficial for the efficiency. Iron chromatography is not being used as much as it could be, but with a new system like that, I think it's getting more accessible. I think for uh, most applications, you can get very nice performance with uh, a system like this. It is an interesting option that now mass spectrometry is connected also to iron chromatography. We can use now mass spectrometry in combination with iron suppression so that we can have a nice signal intensity also with uh, electric play ionization and so forth. I think it widens the scope, uh, the scope of, of the system actually. It expands for us the application of ion chromatography. If we can use complementary detectors, we suffer from detection issues like the strong background noise and with the system I think we can overcome. We have lots of very involved synthetic chemistry which requires mass spectrometry to be able uh, for us to tra track all of the, uh, the impurities in a particular sample. So using these in routine analysis, so can we confirm categorically that a peak that we think is a particular impurity is that uh, and mass spectrometry is one of the ways that we do it. Uh, another uh, aspect is around uh, non-chromophoric analytes. So these are things that we can't see in the UV spectrum and uh, obviously we, we need some way to be able to track them and to identify them and uh, quantitate them occasionally as well. Now we also have multiple detectors which really allows customers uh, and scientists to simplify their assays, to get more data out and really have much more confidence and more actual knowledge in, in their results. Thank you.